Well, I have a quick message that's on my heart to deliver. So, of course, I'm going to let you guys know what's on my mind. Um, starting now, we all need to get serious about our spiritual health. And when I say spiritual health, I'm not just talking about, you know, crystals and spell work or, you know, cute prayers or whatever it is you believe in, whether you're a Christian or whatever. But now is not the time to be out here doing anything that is going to influence your spiritual state. So now is not the time to be going out, getting super drunk or you know, entertaining any type of negativity. With the things that I feel that are coming up, we're going to need to be very spiritually mature. We're going to need to be spiritually protected. So, you know, now's the time to connect with whatever it is you believe in, you know, um, purify yourself, get yourself, you know, steadfast in something. I'm not saying you got to believe in what I believe in, but you need to decide what you believe in and and put your faith to work. We're going to need it. These people playing a dirty game. Like a lot of y'all are walking around here and you're pretty much an empty vessel for all type of negative en entities and negative energies that attach itself to you and you're wondering why you're depressed or you can't seem to concentrate on anything. It's because you're not grounded. You're not spiritually sound in anything. You're just like a bag, a paper bag going through the wind. Everything is attaching itself to you because you're not full of anything. You need to ground yourself in something, in something. If you worship goats, then you need to go and spend time with goats. You have to be filled with something because it's a lot of stuff going around here. And we, we got to be ready, man. You got to get yourself spiritually prepared for warfare.